subscribe welcome back to my channel in this week video i'm going to show you my gm monstery vintage louis vuitton bag i hope you're having a lovely weekend and i'm sure most of you guys are already doing your final or even the first shopping getting ready for christmas so if you're new to my channel you know what to do please don't forget to subscribe hit the notification bell because i upload video every sunday and um, please feel free to comment okay let's get started so this is my vintage gm size so this is the biggest size of Montre from louis vuitton it, this is their very if i remember it right like the very uh, first style of backpack okay it is it has a outer pocket which is, can be useful if you just want an easy access for your phone or ticket and it is lined with this because it's old as you know it'll be lined with the usual brown cloth clothing on it or brown lining material type in gold hardware for the age the zipper glides quite smoothly not bad it has a uh, belt buckle in gold hardware as well and this machete ladder adjustable in three holes on it at the back it has a gold D-ring, which can be handy for hooking, but it's not big enough for you to grab it and hold it this way when you're carrying it. This is it's quite it's big to hook, but not big to hold it to grab it to carry it. And it is it has an adjustable um, strap. The strap is partly leather the usual machete leather it is adjustable so again very handy you can make it long or you can shorten it and this um i don't really know what you call this it's a very stiff strap um, material type okay and then at the back it says um louis vuitton paris because I had it for such a long time, the bottom, it's, it, it's actually sturdy. But because I had it for a while, it has abused it when it was a bit drizzling. So I had some watermarks on it. Even from this side, you can see the bit of the dot on that. But hey, what do you expect? It is quite an old backpack. Uh, Weight-wise it's not bad it's quite light so by the time you put all your stuff it's still manageable it's not that heavy so you open it there you go and it comes with this just a um, leather strings and inside is just one open compartment with a slip pocket which is really good because it's very very deep and inside again with the old version they're really good they always add this d-ring where you can put your pochette or your key rings or anything and it says and then on the front of it it says obviously the serial number apologies if you can hear a little bit of a it's currently raining at the moment when i am filming this video okay and there you go and it's lined and the usual it was written as louis vuitton paris made in france because most of as you know most of them they do made it in france they made it in um, spain or anywhere really so this is the bigger size there you go i'm doing the full rounds the only thing i can say with this type of backpack it can be very annoying because you have to basically tie them and then you have to fasten it because when you're carrying it if you don't belt it it would be 
all over the place. Thank God for this little outside pocket. So for easy access, this is the one I use. The new version of um, base bag or the another, they created so many different type of backpack from Louis Vuitton is zipper all around which i think that's really good but since i already have this i did not bother buying the latest one the new one that it came because i think to me um you can't beat the original but for easy access for comfort and for not really actually for comfort if you, so you don't want to get annoyed really the new version is definitely the way to go this one you can buy it now from a vintage store or any um, uh, pre-love market the ranging depends on the quality the ranging from about 500 pounds and above and because this is bigger one so it's probably a little bit dearer and it is for what for the age it is not bad condition so there you go this is my very very here we go again my very very this is my first backpack designer backpack from louis vuitton so i hope you like it and please share if you have this uh, backpack and don't forget to like and subscribe and i'll see you in next week's video keep smiling bye for now